Okay, so I think the answer might be correct, but let's go ahead and check it. Um, so we have a tire that's 13, it has a radius of 13 inches and 230 revolutions per minute. How fast is a bicycle traveling um, in miles per hour? So really, uh, we just there's quite a few conversions we have to do here. Um, so what we want to do is first figure out the circumference of the tire because that's every revolution um, is how fast or is how far the bike is going to travel the circumference. So every revolution you're going to multiply by the circumference. So circumference is two pi uh, times r, right? So the circumference is going to be when we plug in 13 for radius, we're going to get 26 pi, and we're just going to leave it like that. We don't want to start rounding until the very end. Um, and so that would be that's the circumference, and that is in inches. Okay. And so we'll eventually want to convert that to feet, and then convert that to miles. But right now, that's you know it's a fairly small number, so we don't want to. Um, convert that quite yet so let's go ahead and figure out the distance in inches per minute so if we're going to do 230 revolutions per minute every revolution we're going 26 pi so what we're going to do is we're going to multiply that by 26 pi and so let me get my calculator so 230 times 26 it's going to be 5,980, so 5,980, and then that's going to be pi, and that's going to be inches per minute. So that's how many inches we're traveling per minute. And so if we want to um, convert that to inches per hour, we'll go ahead and multiply by uh, 60, okay? So we'll take that and we'll multiply by 60. So you get a pretty big number, 358,800, and then don't forget the pi, and then inches, uh, that's going to be per hour, okay? Um, but we, uh, we don't want our answer in inches, we want it in miles. So we have a couple of conversions to do here. So first, uh, we got to convert to feet. Okay, so 12 inches is one foot. So what we'll do here is we'll start by dividing by 12 to convert the inches into feet. And so let's see, hopefully it divides nicely. So let's see, we'll divide by 12. And it does, that works out nice. So 29,900, so 29,900, and then don't forget the pi, and now we're at feet per hour, and then now if we want to convert that to um, miles, we're going to have to divide by uh, 5,280. Now that one, I don't think it's going to divide evenly, so let's see, 5,280. So, let's see, divide by 5,280, and so 5 point, I'm going to put 66287, 5.66287, just to be really careful, um, pi, and then now we're at miles, um, oops, miles per hour. And then now we'll go ahead and multiply that and get a decimal. Now, look, I already have this in my calculator. So if I just press times, it'll say answer times. And I'm going to multiply it by pi. And so I get uh, 17. And I guess if we're rounding to the tenths place, that'll be 17.8. So let's see, 17.8 miles per hour. So I guess the answer was a little off right there. So um 17.8 miles per hour so really it's not that bad hopefully once you kind of see the whole picture here uh most of it's really just doing um conversions